In the modern game, the two-handed backhand brings big advantages. The modern game is completely different from the tennis that was played before the 70s, where it was very flat, the serves were not big. Today, the return becomes a major shot and clearly it's easier to return with a two-handed backhand. It's also better to counterpunch and in today's game, counterpunching is extremely important. And finally, the two-handed backhand is also a big advantage when it comes to having to hit over the shoulder. The head-to-head -head between Rafael Nadal and Roger Federer made it so clear that when a player has a one-handed backhand and has to hit too many shots over the shoulders, he gets tired and is easier to attack. There are some advantages also for one-handed backhand. I can name the spin. It's in a way easier to have very, very heavy top spin with a one-handed backhand. It's also easier to switch from a one-handed backhand to the slice one-handed backhand. The players who have a one-handed backhand natural, they have a much better slice backhand. And of course, they look much better.